Well, part of what makes Tampa Bay beautiful is the artwork all over our area, sculptures, architecture, and those murals that line the sides of many buildings. Oftentimes, they make us pause, reflect, and even start conversations. Those conversations are exactly what artists hope to spark with their work. ABC Action News reporter Lydia Vasquez shows us the International Mural Festival making its way through Tampa for the first time. The Worldwide Walls is a series of festivals that happens in nearly 20 other cities all over the world. Here it's called the Tampa Walls, where both local and traveling artists can shake up their paint during a week long mural festival beginning Friday. It's really about like, you know, creating the conversation around these different artists and pieces. Tony Kroll is the director of Tampa Walls. He tells me he hopes the mural festival will give artists like David Fratu a chance to tap into their creative expression. I'm painting a geometric abstract mural. Fratu says he's been a full time artist for 10 years. Art means to me that, you know, I, I have the freedom to to express myself and share that with the community and uh, the work that I do uh, gives people a moment of reflection to uh, reflect upon themselves. Kroll tells me he believes community thrives on diversity and that's what he's hoping the mural festival will bring to the streets of Tampa. We want to showcase, you know, women artists, male artists, black artists, Latino artists, you know, indigenous artists. Like there's all types of ways that we can, you know, incorporate the person like personal expression into our communities. Kroll says he's working with private businesses and the city and hopes to paint up 10 murals throughout Seminole Heights, Tampa Heights and the West Shore District. We really are trying to inspire like younger artists and up and coming artists to know that they can do this sort of work in our communities as well. In Tampa, Lydia Vasquez, ABC Action News.